Hey, today I'm going to record the sign uh, stock outlook 2014 and I've been waiting uh, quite a while uh, to create this uh, stock forecast because today it is a very important day as I will uh, demonstrate we are seeing uh, uh, we are giving in fact or issuing trade alerts on the Chinese market in some stocks which I consider uh, at that point or at this point that they uh, you should uh, close entirely uh, long positions this this is in fact a historical day uh, as I record this live and I, I'm going to show you what I'm referring to in the case of uh, Dang Dang uh, one of the best uh, uh, profits with the stock triple digit gain uh, the same situation in Yoiko strong buy uh, I already announced this last year in 2013 and also in uh, uh, this stock this company and also I'm going to address the case of Baidu so in this case of sign I already addressed last year that I quit the short side after betting on the collapse I paid the stock to uh, strong buy with a very specific target region uh, that is the one that you see on the chart the 85 to 95 you have the here the mid-term uh, support and you have here the target region that uh, I was looking for and that you saw last year in 2013 after that target region uh, the stock plunged all the way down to 65 or 66 uh, more or less and then it, it currently it is bouncing from support uh, to 74 so the question here is whether this stock is a buy or a sell but to answer to this question I have to refer to other stocks in the market namely Chinese stocks that is the most important in this lesson okay so here you see the short term chart the support if you have a long position bear in mind that you cannot or you should not let profits turn into a lo into losses so you don't have any reason in fact to let that happen it's just you have to use a trailing stop trailing stop has to be used in case of the shares they break this the blue line to downside you have to protect your position because that would imply a break to downside and therefore a resume of the downtrend in my perspective if you have a short position on the stock you also don't have any reasons to close the short position because there is a potential downtrend uh, going forward in this stock namely if it is unable to break uh, I would say 82 dollars more or less and this because I quite frankly I don't visualize I think this stock uh, or this company this stock lost the opportunity to rally uh, in 2014 I might be wrong but I'm going to explain it precisely using the other stocks that I've been discussing here in the service the Dang Dang the Baidu and uh, the Yoko case that they are very important okay so I've been always saying that Baidu is the number one in terms of quality Saina is uh, the second in a certain sense uh, Yoiko is uh, the third and Dang Dang it is the fourth or the last one in the sense of uh, speculation uh, so uh, I repeat Baidu, Saina, Yoiko and Dang Dang so speculative plays they can obviously make uh, uh, very important profits uh, speculative plays as I've been addressing this is the case of Baidu the chart you notice here that uh, we have or we still have a strong buy rating in this stock I'm not sure how much you can rally but my upside is higher than this and there is a lesson in fact about uh, Baidu so I have an upside and we have a long position and uh, this is the only stock that I recommend you to uh, maintain a long position and not this one because this is the case of Dang Dang precisely today we have been issuing trade alerts in the last couple of days in Dang Dang as well as in Yoiko today you have here the pullback in Yoiko and this is one of the most profitable opportunities last year uh, I referred to it and uh, in 2014 I already downgraded this stock to neutral 
uh, in fact to sell uh, therefore I recommend already to sell short and I think that today you have a wonderful opportunity if you didn't close the short positions to close today the long positions and to reverse to the short side so you have today a wonderful opportunity in my perspective to sell short to sell long positions in speculative plays the dang dang case the Yoriko case to go short and uh, quite frankly these are our priorities so you you might have a position here in China but sign it is not a priority for us our priority going forward or in 2014 it is a short position in dang dang and uh, uh, to be long uh, Baidu because I consider that Baidu is the best of them all and uh, um, to go short uh, Yoiko and Yoiko in fact of them all to be the one that can uh, uh, sell off the most that is my opinion okay having said this you see in our video portal already here lessons uh, already published lessons stock outlooks uh, how much higher can Chinese Dang Dang stock go? Uh, this has a trade alert there. The best Chinese stocks to invest in uh, 2014. So what I published here, I'm pretty sure that in the future, what I said there, it will be used to create case studies. As probably what I'm saying here, it will be used also to create case studies because those videos are, or these videos are the material, or it constitutes the material that then we use uh, to uh, share information with you and also for case studies we have more than uh, almost 3,000 I think case studies with all this uh, recorded live so don't forget that I don't expect this uh, stock I might be wrong but I don't expect this stock to go uh, to that uh, high and uh, this uh, in February low uh, and the bonds that you are seeing here and the correction then to support it appears to be bullish but since I'm bearish uh, Dang Dang and Yoiko and you have seen here at $74 I repeat that if you have a long position you cannot let the profit turn into a loss and bear in mind that I'm using here this bull line precisely to for you to use it as guidance so if the shares they lose the support that is the blue line don't remain uh, long the stock because then the stock can eventually sell off significantly from here uh, and the, you understand because all these stocks they are correlated uh, so I, I accept eventually the case of Baidu because Baidu is the number one um, so all the speculative plays and including China in a certain sense China can suffer uh, with a potential sell-off or reversal if you see one in Baidu and uh, uh, Dang Dang sorry in uh, Yoiko and Dang Dang right um, so that is what I have to say therefore uh, I'm going to finalize the only buy is Baidu all the rest this is at most neutral to sell and dang dang strong sell and uh, uh, yoiko strong sell the best strong sell in my perspective to be yoiko the second one to be uh, dang dang because of its nature then this one and the only one that i will not sell short it will be uh, baidu so i think that i said uh, everything and here you have the long-term chart in China where we started precisely discussing this since the very top and predicting all the bonuses and the, you know the crash the major crash in China all the way down to the very bottom so far in 2012 okay although on a long-term basis I cannot say that this button here uh, it is an ultimate button because uh, no one knows Today we are publishing Sina case study, one of the worst performers in 2014. And uh, if you refer to my comments, uh, the Sina stock outlook 2014, you see that I was uh, pretty much accurate uh, when I commented that uh, Sina, the future of the stock was likely correlated to the action 
in other speculative plays in the Chinese stock market, namely uh, Dang Dang and uh, Yoiko. So this is the chart that you have inside since uh, the stock outlook. This is the price that you have in Yoiko, one of the best shorts uh, in the stock market that I already addressed. When I published a lesson in China, uh, the stock was trading, I believe, above uh, $37. So uh, that was exactly the top in uh, Yoiko. You see that today this stock is $18.20. And the other one, uh, which I refer also as a speculative play, therefore three stocks on the same lesson, and I'm referring to Dang Dang, the stock also plunged from exactly the top, that is the where I recorded the lesson, all the way down to $9. So a uh, crash of 50% in Dang Dang, and then the stock bounced to 16 as well, you know, and the stock since then pulled back. So all these, uh, uh, the lesson in the end that I published in uh, the, um, about uh, Sina Stock Outlook, it has been used to invest, to trade all these stocks. And bear in mind, as I said in the case of, uh, when I published the case of Sina, Baidu remained the only buy in the Chinese tech sector. And by the way, the best performer, I think the stock was trading around $180 uh, when I published the lesson. And uh, you have here the Yoiko, the, sorry, the Baidu case. So the stock was trading around here. And uh, the stock is now $220, basically. So we can go back uh, some months. As you can see, the stock pulled back from that 180 all the way down to my downside, that was 156. In fact, uh, the stock traded low uh, below the downside. That was a buying opportunity below the moving average to underline, and the stock rallied all the way up to $230. So uh, the Baidu proved to be, and I show you again, the charts in the other stocks, the Yoiko case, precisely the opposite. So the stock crashed, the Dang Dang case, the stock crashed 50%, as you can see, since that call. And uh, the case of uh, Sina, it ended up to be even worse than Dang Dang, as I explained. The, there was no bonds whatsoever in this stock. So, my friends, four stocks in one single lesson. Congratulations to everyone. This corresponds to millions of dollars to hedge fund managers in one single lesson. Thank you.